Hey everybody, welcome to uh, Britpop Shack. You're me, BP1. Uh, no BP2 today because we're here to give you more content. I'm here with Pearl Jam. Now we've done them once before on the channel, um, and I can't actually remember the song. I think it was Even Flow, um, and we gave it a good score. We gave it over nine, which for us is really good. Um, so nine out of ten. So we must have enjoyed this. Uh, this one, looking back at some of your comments, you said go check out Black. Um, so we've got this from Pink Pop 1992. Um, interested to see, you know, obviously Pearl Jam, big American band uh, that we didn't really know much about at all. Um, so first time hearing this for me, Black. Uh, we'll just get straight into it. If you enjoy the video as we go, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button and come with us uh, at Britpop Shack. We do all sorts on the channel. Um, and you get me and BP2 normally, uh, but I'm just here to give you a bit more content on the channel as well. All right, uh, and your thumbs up always helps. Anyway, enough of that. Uh, let's get into it. Pearl Jam. Okay. I don't remember that boy. Bag hanging out his mouth. Cigarette that is. Means something completely different over here. We've done the US information video on that. Fag cigarette. Uh, yeah, like this. Um, those of you that know me will know that I, you know, I'm a bit partial to a Nirvana. Um, and he's got that similar sort of tone of voice, isn't he? He's got that sort of. It's that. You know, I was just starting to get into music at this age, and and you know that sort of long drawn out vocal you know on the words that real sort of deep sort of american twang i guess on this on on this sort of um this sort of era wasn't it those early 90s quite grungy with the low shorts the socks and the you know the bands and everything so the hair it got that vibe is he got that sort of vibe and and you can feel it, it it's taking me back to to the 90s which is great um so yeah, yeah, I, I like this so far. It's cool. It's a good song. It's not going too far at the moment. He's got a good vocal. Um, yeah, it's almost like a rocky sort of indie grungy ballady song at the moment. So, uh, but it's cool. I like it. I'm enjoying. It. <laughs> That's good, man. It's 
It's got the vibe of a big song, isn't it? It really has. Um, I'm laughing because the guitarist that was in the background, he just looked high as a guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure that, you know, muscle memory must have just been well in control there because I'm not sure he knows what's going on. But it's hilarious It's to, to take you back to those sort of 90s vibes in that era uh, like that. All right, Black. What is Black? Black is a power ballad by uh, Pearl Jam. The song is its fifth track on the band's debut album, 10, uh, released in 1991, and features lyrics written by vocalist Eddie Vedder uh, and music written by guitarist Stone Gossard. The song originated as an instrumental demo under the name E Ballard uh, that was written by guitarist Stone uh, in 1990. It was one of the five songs compiled onto a tape called Stone Gossard Demos uh, 91 that had circulated in the hopes of finding a singer and a drummer for Pearl Jam. Okay, so we had popped it on, got it on a demo tape looking for a singer. Uh, and a drummer. It's funny how these things these things come in, and obviously Eddie come on board um, and, and wrote the lyrics to the to the the song. So brilliant, brilliant, uh, good bit of information there. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, do thumbs up the video. It does help us out of the channel. We like to give you a bit of education about the track um, as well as our reactions uh, on the channel. Uh, BP2 normally gives you some really good info as we're going along um, as well. All right, uh, I'm enjoying it though. It's a good. Like I say, anything that takes me back to certain eras, you know, I'm getting that 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 vibe, um, and I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it in my head. It's taking me it's taking me back. Wow, layered. Wow, layered. It transports you. Wow. Look at this look at the crowd. Fixation. Wow. That's going to get big cheers. I mean, wow. Quality. Look at that. Brilliant. I mean, how much passion do you want? Right from the word go, as soon as he hit that mic, he never left it. And he was just on it. Um, you know, and that's, that's, that is quality, isn't it? That is quality. Um, you know, you see people out there singing songs, different type of front men. But they're passionate about that song you could really feel it as he was coming through yeah i enjoyed that pearl jam do you know what yeah pearl jam what do we give that on the old scoreboard deserves a nine from me yeah deserves a nine because it transportation me back to the 90s you know fixation on him just watching it i found myself i forgot i was even doing a reaction channel I, my brain was just in it um and that's that that's that deserves a nine out of ten from me yeah i enjoyed that uh good one eddie and, and the gang 
Uh, that was from uh, Pink, Post Fe uh, Pink Pop Festival in the Netherlands in 1992, uh, just in case you're wondering where that was from. Um, thanks for joining me, uh, BP1 here at Britpop's React. Make sure you join us tomorrow for another reaction. Uh, plenty on the channel, so make sure you come with us. Uh, until then, it's goodbye from me today. Bye. He's a 20th century boy.